Welcome to Yeshiva Daf. Share sponsor Lu Nishmas Arm Yaakov Shalom Le'ab HaSitzchuk. We're only about Metziah Dafnon. Metziah Dafnon is known as the Sugyo of Tagori Lud, which is a little complicated in the Pshat to understand the Mahalach of the Gemara. There is two main Pshat to understand the Sugyo, which is the Sheet of Rashi and the Sheet of Tais, very long Tais over here, as you can see in Umdalif. So it's really two ways to understand. We're going to focus on Rashi because the, when you get into the Cheshboinus of Taisis, it makes it look complicated to follow the Mahalach of the Gemara. So we'll focus on the Sheet of Rashi, and stand just to focus in this case on the Poshib Shat of the Gemara, the Mahalach of the Gemara. So the Gemara says the following. As a, as a preview, let's just go back a second to remember the Mechlikis that we had in the Mishnah. That Kedai, just in order, in order for us to get into, the, into this daf, let's just see the Mishnah one more time inside. The Mishnah said that we're starting in the middle of the Mishnah. Because the Mishnah said that Oino is a Shtos. Shtos is a, <coughs> a six. A six of the of the amount we saw in yesterday's daf. The question, do you go based on the Mecca or based on the money? But it's a six. And then the Mishnah said, Until when can you give it back? Until the guy goes and shows it to some expert. So whatever time it takes to show to the expert, that's the time a person can come and change his mind. After you show it to the expert, it's too late. Now you can't show it anymore. Now you have to, now you can't return back to Mecca. So the Tafan Lud announced, Not a six, but a third. Meaning you can, a person can make a mistake and make a no up to a third of the Mecca. So anything which is worth six, instead of selling it for seven, he could sell it for, for eight. Two more than than the six. The sellers, the 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 seicharim in lud, the tagarim, the ones who the wholesalers were very happy because now they could start selling things at a higher amount, and the there will no be there will be no bitul meka. Says the Gemara, it says the Mishnah, Amar lehem kol yoyim utalal. Say yeah, but he could check if the the buyer goes and checks out and sees that it's a that it's that he made a mistake, so he could change his mind not only until he shows it to an expert, but the entire day. So then, then they said, "We don't need this." The the fact that he can change the back to Mecca such a long time that ruins it for us. We want him to give a few minutes. He can go to an expert, show it. After a few minutes of time. Comes the buyer and says, "I want to change it. Too late. You have the amount. You have, they have the time to come back. The time is very is very short, and they prefer that they, the 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 you know it's not a shtus, it's not a shlish, but a shtus. It's half of the amount of time for him. But as long as you can, the this option of coming back is over immediately. Or actually, the So that was the mishnah. Says the Gemara. In the third line, the from Daf Ibailu, Pachus mishtus le'rabbanon." We know that if it's less than a shtos, <coughs> what's the deal less than a shtos? That even less than a shtos is, that then you, it's a mechila, right? The buyer who bought something which is worth six, he bought it for six and a half. That extra half, it's a mechila. Is that mechila immediate once you bought something of six for six and a half year of mechila? Or it's not, it's not immediate. It is at the time it takes to go short an expert. The fact they have a mechila is it also you have, you have some time. You don't have time. If you want to tell me there is some time, so there won't be exactly different between shtus and pachas shtus. In both cases, until you show the expert, you can change your mind, and I want back the the I, I want to, I want to change something over here. The more doesn't know exactly what's the difference. So the more equal, there is a difference. Till shtus yodal el yoyno. If it's a six, if it's exactly a six, he sold him an item worth six for seven. So then, yes, you have two options. You could say, I either don't want this sale at all, give me back my money. Or you say, you know what, we'll have a sale, give me back that extra one that you took from me. That's the between a shtus and yasem shtus. But if it's less than a shtus, if you're talking about that he sold something of six to six and a half, kanu no. <coughs> so then he has until he goes to the expert, he has the option to change his mind. I mean, not to change his mind, to, to demand the difference. Go back and say, well, one second, you sold me as an item which is worth six. 
you sold to me for six and a half. Give it back to me, the half. After he shows it to X, but he can't give it back half. So that's the difference. Meaning, if it's a shtus, he has the option to say, I don't want the sale at all. If it's if it's less a shtus, he can't say, I don't want the sale at all. He can just demand the extra. Says, well, mine. So what's the, what is the deal? Toshma, in other words, do you, have, do you have time if it's less than a shtus? Toshma, chazru, lidivrei, chachor. So it's way up in the mishto. Chachor and Lud weren't very happy with what our Tarifun gave him. If Tarifun said, you could change, you could do a shlish, but you have the entire day. So they said, you know what? We're not happy with it. Says so the Gemara, what exactly, uh, what exactly happened over here? What changed for them? Savrua, the Gemara understood. Pachos mishlish lertafrin ke pachos mishtus lerabonadan. According to Rabtafrin, you have up to a third. A third is a no. Less than a third is a mechil. Simple to what we have in Then a shtus is a no. Less than a shtus, less than a six. Is is a, is an achilah. So if we take the, the example we spoke about till now, he sold an item worth six. According to our top one, if he sells it up to eight, there's a mechila. Anything between six to eight, six, six and a half, seven, seven and a half, seven and three quarters, all that is included in the mechila of, of, of that you have in less than a third. So we, we're comparing less than a third by our top one to less than a six by our bottom. <coughs> it says one. Bishop, you want to tell me the lesson is just according to your bonon is in order to show it to, to an expert. So you have time to change your mind. Meaning, it's a mechila, but the mechila is only, only kicks in once he shows it to an expert. If he did not show it to an expert yet, he doesn't, there's no mechila. He says, I want back that extra money. For our time for him, our time for him says the same thing. He says, not only a shtus, he says a third. And he says, you know, until you show it to the expert, you have the entire day to do what? The entire day you can come and ask for that extra. Oh, this is what I understand. Why they were Why they didn't like this track? Because they said, we can always sell a little bit more. We can sell for, we can sell selling something which is worth six. But for six, we'll sell it for six and a half. According the guy has five minutes to go, five minutes, ten minutes to go show an expert. After that, it's over. But our time, it says, yeah, you can sell it up to, up to, uh, up to uh, eight. With worth six, I can sell it for seven. That's great. But the guy has the whole day to go check it out. So usually, he, 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 he will come and demand it. He has enough time to go check it out. So that's why they, cha- they change your mind. Right? Listen, let's see a little Rashi on this part. Shurashi, because the last Rashi in the moment. Be some who begin to be happy. The shtus the yoyser shtus at shlish the rabbanon have a chazara. By the toch kedesh shiri. In other words, if shtus is more, they can decide I don't want any of the deal over here. If you want to lach so make a chayzer. If you want to change, as I don't do the make a he can he can change. The chashim leyu mechilo the kono umachzer na. What our tavern holds? No, it's a mechilo. It's gone. Umachzer na. The chomelu kol yoyim. The ones he said I have the whole day. Rabbanon say you could do it till you show to the expert. He says the whole day. You have to give it back. Oh, there's his difference. According to Rabbanon, he can change, he can say, I don't want to do the sale at all. More than the shtus. And according to him, up to a third, you can't avoid the sale, just get the difference. According to Rashi, this is Rashi Shito. It's more comfortable for them for the fact there will be a very quick amount of time the guy can go to the expert. He said, yeah, yeah we, we can always go and and um, and uh, we, we have the, we, we're gaining the fact Anything above seven, in the case that someone sells for six, you can void the sale. But at the end of the day, the guy can come and ask for that difference the whole day. So really, we're not gaining much. If you take a little sword, just to add to what Rashi says, it's just a sword. Tagore Lulud understood that most people, within the day, if you have the whole day, they will figure out there was a mistake over here. So what do we gain? We gain that hey, if I'm selling something for six, not only up to six, up to seven, the, 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 there's a mechilo. But even more than seven is a mechilo, till eight. 
Yeah, but most people will catch on to it and they'll ask for that difference. So what do we gain? Very good. Says the Gemara, But if you hold that when it's less than a shtos, you don't have the time to go to an expert. That's all that's out of the suffix. Immediately, once a guy sells, once a seller sells something which is worth six to six and a half, it's all, you can't come and ask for the back. So according to Rabbi Tafir, once you sell something for six, four, seven, seven and a half, you, you, you try to write Mechilo. So what, is, so what, what, what change over here? It's like, what, if you don't obey, it's Rabbi Tafir, now we're going to have Mechilo. According to Rabbi Tafir, immediately he lost the difference. In my chazo, in my chazo, why did it change, it change your mind? But the tarfoin nichol utfei. What we have tarfoin has is much better, right? What? Why? We'll see first outside, then we'll see it inside. A quote to tarfoin. What happens? Any you selling an item of six, anything from six to eight, the immediate the seller sells it, the sale is gone. It's done. You can't ask for any any returns, any refunds. That's much better. According to our button, it's only from six to seven. You have that case. Anything above seven, according to Rabbanon, he can has it. He has not only he can ask for the difference, he can not only he, he can also not only ask for the difference, he can even ask. I said I want to get now, though I want to ch- I don't want to avoid the whole sale. According to Rabbanon, I have I have the I have from six to eight to do anything I want, and not only that, not only I can do the whole thing, the 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 the, the showing. In other words, for six to eight, there's no showing to an expert. Let's look at what says. Let's look at the mind of Rabban Kamash will know. Rabban holds, and so I know he can demand the difference or avoid the sale, meaning seven and above. Hey, you can't beat that. They could sell anything they want for a third more, uh, up to a third more than a price, and immediately uh, the, the sale is, is finalized. <coughs> so they won't know. You're making your mistake. We're assuming that whatever, according to Rav a third is a shtus. Less is less than a shtus. A third is, I know. Less is less than I know. Like Rav then a six is, I know. Less than I know. Whatever Rav holds less than a six, Rav Tafon holds less than a third. That's what we're assuming. It says the Gemara, no, it's not true. Mishtus that shlish Rav Tafon, kishtus atzvo le Rav Bonon dan. The, the, what Rav Tafon says like this, up to a six, there's no mochlekes. Mechila right away, according to the Tzad of the Gemara. According to Rabbana, six itself, this is where you have a choice. You can either ask for the difference or nevata mechila. More than a six, so then is it's a, it, the, 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 the sale is bottle, right? According to, if you hold more than a six. Rav Tafon says, no, from six until a third, it all has a din of a six. Kishtu tatu labor dami. All is there as the number six. Right? Um, right? And according to our bottom, they both get the, the, the you can you can be vital the sale. What's the as Rashi points out? What's the difference between more than a shtos and a shtos? More than a shtos, the seller and the buyer can say let's avoid the sale. Shtos itself, only the one who is misana, only the one that lost, can say I want to avoid the sale, give me the difference. But so, so, so he says, according to Rav Tafon, from six until a third, that whole range has a din of the, the, the same thing as Shtus Rabban. So he says, so really what? Really? Says the Gemara, that's why the Tugger, Tugger and Lud weren't so happy. Because yes, up to a six, there's no Mokhlik of Tafon and Rabban. They all agree that it's Mechil. More than a, from a six uh, up to a third, it, the, the din is that you can change your right. So when he told him, I'm asking you like a platform, they said, oh, very nice. I have a little bit more of a range of, of, uh, uh, of a shtus. It wasn't explained to why what, what they happy about it. But he says, you know, but they have the whole day to be choyzer. That's not good for us. Says the Gemara, what, what they're so happy about? Why are they happy? What did you gain? So I'll tell you what you gain. Tif shoyt, and this is the next suffer of the Gemara, which we'll get to in a moment. Oh, you know what the difference is? When you are more than a six, according to Rabbanon, six has a din of a shtus. You have the option to either ask for the difference or change or, or avoid the sale. Until when? Until you show it to an expert. What about more than a six? More than a six, you can avoid, you can avoid, they can avoid. How long? The boy is going to bring a suffix soon. How long is that? 
So well, let's assume that, that you can avoid it forever. Anything more than a six, according to Abba, you can avoid it forever. They came out, they were up top with how very no. So once he told him, by the way, this is not a, this is not more than a six. This is anything from a six to a third will have the din of a six. That what? That you can't void it forever. You can void it only for a certain amount of time. But then he said, no, you can avoid it only till you can avoid it the entire day. Not only until to the expert, but the entire day. So there was a little game that much. Between one day, as Rashi points out over here, between one day or a month, most people already figure out the price within that day. <coughs> so I, I understand now what happened in their mind. What changed? I thought they could do Bitulika forever, more than a six, if you hold the Kabon on, because the Tarvet says, no, 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 from a six to a third, he has a din of a six. You can't live out it forever. If you hold, then even more than a six, you have a time limit to show to an expert. What were they happy about? What did they gain? Right? You could show it to a to a Togger Kraver in any case. They didn't gain much. And they can't change your mind. Only the body can change your mind if it's less, if it's less, if it's still so less. Right? If you look at Rashi, Rashi says, um, First of all, what were they happy about if you hold that the shtus, that, that, that uh, the, the, more than a shtus, according to our body, loyal and chazer, and according to our top for him, you're not chazer loyal, says Rashi. Sorry, four. Um, um, okay, so for that Rashi, maybe we can not see Rashi inside. The difference is, is it, is it that the, the first Rashi says that the point is that, that like we said, now, originally, they thought, oh, now you can't change your mind forever. You have a time limit. So, yeah, but the time limit is not until you show it to the expert. The time limit is the whole day. So, they weren't happy. It says, Rash, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, As we mentioned, one day or ten days, not a big difference. Why? Within one day, you'll figure out the case. He added a timeline. He added a time. So, so what it says, if if you hold the bitul mekas <coughs> you can do it. You could do it uh, forever, and you can do it only for a time limit. Uh, so what? So why is it here? Maybe I didn't emphasize enough. When you're according to Rabbana, when you are more than a shtus, who can change his mind? Only the buyer, not the seller. I mean, sorry. If it's a shtus itself, own the buyer, not the seller. Once it's more than a shtus, they both can change mind. Because of Tafir, it says, no, from a shtus until a third, it's all the same din. Meaning, who, who lost over here? The seller lost. He can't change his mind. So why are they so happy? Says the Gemara, some who bishtus atzmo. They were happy in the actual six. Why? Tafir, Tafir, Mechil, Rabbo, no, no. And now they're going to change something. And this is a little... Very interesting to understand. The taste is discussed a little bit, uh, but what is Rashi according to Rashi in this case of the Gemara? Gemara said, Gemara changes one thing. The Gemara understood till now, in, this, in stage two of the Gemara, Gemara in the beginning of the Gemara understood that anything below six, Larabanon, is equal to below third term Then the Gemara says, no, no, no. Below six and below, uh, uh, below six term Tafel is exactly below six Larabanon. More than six, so then it's, it's, it changes. Says the Gemara now, yeah, one small difference. More than a six, according to our Tafra, it's like it changes like our bottom. But six itself, it's still like below, like the have in So if we have to come and, and, and say it in an exact form, when you have, you're selling an item of six, the Gemara in the beginning understood that from 6.01 until 7.99, till you get to eight, According to Rabbi Tafurin, it's considered to be a mechil. Said the Gemara, no. From seven until eight, it's not a mechil right away, but you have to have time to show it. To, you have to show it. Said the Gemara, yeah, but there's one difference between Rabbi and Tafurin. Seven itself. The shtus itself. Ma mishtus. According to Rabbi once you reach seven, 6.99 is a mechil. 7.01, it's, it's a bit mekach. Seven itself is the din of a shtus. And what's the din of a shtus? It's not a mechila anymore. Then the, the buyer has the, has the option to do to either bevat the mecca or get back his money. 
says it says Rav Tarfur, and I hold that seven itself is like below seven. And seven itself, which is below seven, it's a mechila. Oh, so now Tagore Lud, for some reason it seems like it comes up from the Sugya, Kurtu Rashi, that Shtus itself, that was a common way of people adding value, adding profit. And this was the very, the, why Tagore Lud was so happy. Because when you get to, they, they got to the Shtus itself. They could sell something for six until 6.99, but they can't sell for seven. They wanted to sell for seven. According to our bottom, once you get to seven, it's not a mechila anymore. According to our top, it's seven, it's still a mechila. So seven is, is something that, that the, no, the, the buyer cannot demand from the seller. But then came Rav Tafel and told him, yeah, but he has the whole day to change his mind. So that, that, is, that we didn't really gain much. If you have five, ten minutes to show to an expert, okay, so five, ten minutes, we hope you he won't, he won't figure it out. He has the whole day, if you show, he'll come back. We didn't gain much according to that. But if you have more, more than seven, so then, um, so then there's not a real difference between Rabbi and Rabbi Tafel. According to Rabbi, according to Rabbi it's worse for the seller. Because according to Rabbi on more than seven, they both could change their mind. According to Rabbi more than seven, only the buyer could change his mind, not the seller, and, and, and it doesn't have a different mechila. So really, according to Rabbi more than seven, it's worse for them. The only place where there's a little regain is seven itself. That's the reason they were so happy because it's seven itself until they told them that the time limit is much longer. So that, that has to do with the first topic of the Gemara. So what was the first topic of the Gemara? The Gemara has, was asking, when you say the less of the Shtus is a Mechila, is that immediate? Or that's Kadesh Yire La Togur La Kriva. And the Gemara did bring a Raya for Togur Lut that, um, that, uh, um, that they wanted to say that it's Kadesh Yire La Togur La Kriva. Um, and so that, that's, that's, it's all right, it's immediate. And that's what they thought. They were so happy because they thought it was immediate and that's what we would change. <coughs> I mean, the, the, we wanted to show, sorry, we wanted to show that it's not immediate because it was immediate. They, they gained so much. So they wanted to say. So the one says no because according to our less than a third is not equal to less than a six according to our body. It's also, it's, you have some sort of time limit so therefore they didn't gain that much. Okay. So that's the one now. Now we're going to the suffix the more I mentioned before. Uh, right, just to mention, maybe just uh, just as uh, on the summary that we just mentioned, Mishtus at Shlish Tera Tafon is like a Shtus Mini Akurit. What what did Gamora change from six until a third according to Tafon? They're really losing. That's what they, because they they only the buyer can change his mind, not the seller. So all he gained is the six itself. Six itself is the only thing they're getting. Okay, very good. Talk to you more now. Ibailu, according to Taisis and Rashi, Taisis says you could say day Ibailu, because we just mentioned it before. If what's the topic? Bitu Mekar Lerabonon, once you more than a shtos. Lo ilum chayzer, when you can change, can you go back and ask for that money? Always. Or dil bichdei shiyare letogel lekoivo. Only, you have still a time limit to show it to the next one. Bein titzvayim bichdei shiyare letogel lekoivo. It says, but if you want to tell me there's a very small time limit, so what's between shtus and shtus? Shtus and yes, shtus, you have only a small amount of time to show it. And after that, it's over. So what's the big difference? So this is what we mentioned already several times. Shtus, only the one who lost can change his mind. Or ask for the money, or... Or avoid the, the sale. More than a shtus, they both could say, let's let's give it up. It's what Toshva. Now we're going back to the Raya that we spoke about to Gori Lut. <coughs> Go back to Bichor. Right? According to Rabbanon, more than a six, more than a six, is the, the Mekach's bottom. And that is only. That's bichti shiir al tagul akrevi. Me according to that side of the Gemara, you have you have to show it to, to an expert. Well, the tafur kol ayoyim, and according to the tafur, you can still do it the whole day to go in taino. The shabbal I understand why they change their mind because according to rabbanon, it's only it's only a, a few minutes. After a few minutes, it's over. The sale is is is, is you can you can return the sale. And according to the tafur, you have the whole day to 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 change it. 
forever. Am I chosen with Avon Yichlut Fe? The Kabash will call Anu Ekol Ayoy to be too long. Say, well, I don't understand. What, 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 why? Why? According? Why did they change? Comes with Tavon tells us. Oh, by the way, you have the whole day. It, 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 if you don't own like a like a Tavon, so how much? How long do you have? Well, depends. For Shtos, so you have until you show to an expert. More than Shtos, yeah, you, you have forever. So the chur of Tafford is much better because more than a shtus, from a shtus until a third at least. According to Tafford, you have only a day. According to Rabbanon, you have forever. So the chur of Rabbanon are better. It says the Gemara, bitul mekach l'shliach. They have more than a shtus, not shliach. So you want to tell me, similar to what we said, the Rashi puts it out. Similar to what we said before. Before we said, we, said, we spoke about the shtus itself. We're very happy with the shtus itself. That's what we're so happy with. What about more than a shtus? So it more says now, more than a shtus, according to Rabbanon, he can change his mind the whole time. According to Tafri, he, has, he only has the ad day. So more than a shtus, people don't really care so much because it's not so shkech. Let's see Loshu Rashi. If you say you can always change your mind. It says Rashi, Even if you want to tell me that the shtus itself is or no. I don't know. Let's talk about Shusat. So Shinui Trikam. At the beginning, when the Gemara said, the Gemara, in the question, the Gemara says that you want to tell me that they're happy with the exact a six. We should see what the Mikor the we should see what the Mikor Kashal be my. So we should talk about the see what the Mikor we should be to make him. They have it in the Rabbanu. Lo, you know, Tavra Suri Kedai Shiri Kedino Ino. The Rabbanu. Right. So the Gemara Rashi says in the beginning that to say the Gemara understood at least in the question of the Gemara. That to say shtus itself, that's what they're happy about. It's a little doichak. We understand even more than for they, they were relying on the fact that they could do a no more than shtus. They could sell something which is worth six for seven and above. So it says, It's still very, very great. Because according to Abba, is forever. And according to Abba, it's only kola yoy. Right? Um, as Rashi goes and it says, more than shtus, they gain so much more than shtus. So says Rashi, next, you skip the next Rashi. Bitu mekach the shchiach. They ain't shmach ze choshu lehem b'mid lo shchiach. Not shchiach. They came mikra be'avi na me'ari natalu shuz kol ayoyim lachzar. And even if you want to tell me, okay, what happens? You still have the whole day. Fair on milachim milachim ba ba'yoyim. He'll go gam dishtus atzva or diflu. So then the shtus that's all. So that's what Tzitz really points out according to Rashi, because the Gemara in the original case said, ah. Oh, why, according to Rabtav, according, according to the Arsophic in the first case, what was the Simcha Tagore Lut? Says the Gemara, it was the Shtus. They were happy with the Shtus. More than the Shtus didn't make sense because they actually lose her according to the first case of the Gemara. So, what was it? They were happy with the Shtus. Now the Gemara is asking, what are they happy with the Shtus? Eh, that's a doichek. It's probably happy with more than the Shtus. So, what changed? Says they weren't know they were happy with the Shtus. So, according to Rashi, it comes out that the Mahalach of the Gemara, the beginning of the Gemara said, that shtus, that's what they're happy about. Nothing more said, no, no, no. To say it's only shtus, a doichak. And then we go back to say that they're happy with the shtus. That's what Tais asks a Rashi. That's very funny. How the, you know, the Gemara. That's what Tais has his own shot in the Gemara to say something else. But right now, according to Rashi, this really, we're going back and forth at this point. Originally, we wanted to say they're happy with the shtus. Gemara doesn't like that so much. It's probably they're happy for more than the shtus. The fact that they're able to, to that there's a time limit. The more than the shtus, there's a time limit. And according to Rabbanon, there's no time limit. And according to that, why they what, 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 what so why why they why they uh, they change their mind? Says the Gemara that they're, they're more than shtus is not shchiach. Really, they're focused on the shtus itself, and the shtus itself. Everybody has a time limit, and Rabbanon have a shorter time limit, so that's why they wanted that. So according to Rashi, the shtus is the main focus. Says the Gemara, Now we're going to see the Rava is going with one sheet. According to Rashi, he's going with one sheet. Pakus mishtus nikra mekach. What's the shtus? The sale is 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 a good sale. You are selling shtus bitul mekach. More than shtus, it's bottle. Shtus kono machzor no. Shtus there is a kinyan or machzor no. All this is because she will tagle a You have to show the entire cases are the show the tagle a to an expert. That's what it is. So you see, Rava changed a little bit when we're going to them, as the Gemara is going to say in a moment. Let's see the Gemara bring the two sheets and we'll see how Rava goes. Tali can say the Rava. How brass like Rava? Oh no, pochad b'shtus. Right away. I mean, I mean, not right away. I'm saying, but but it's but it's the 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 sale is a good sale. The mekach is bottle. 
Shtus kono machzirino is kono machzirino divir Rebbe. Rebbe Nosson. And that's how Rova said. According to Rashi, Rova goes Rav Nosson. Rabbi Yudha Nosson imir no. That moichel elyoyna rotsoy mo hotel le mikri hotel le mashia nisani. He has a choice. He can either avoid the sale or ask for the difference. And all, for ask for the difference. So here's, this is what, what changed. According to Rova, according to Rav Nosson. In shtus itself, when you have shtus itself, can you, is, if you say the sale is a good sale, you just get the difference? Or he has a choice. He can either say the sale is a good sale and, and give me the difference, or I avoid the sale. So according to Rabbi Yudha, he has a choice. According to, to Rav, according to Rabbi Nassan, um, he doesn't have a choice. The sale is a good sale, you just get the difference. So according to, 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 to Rav, it's a very clear cut. Less than a shtus, nothing happened over here. I mean, it's a, it's a Yavah Mechilo. The, the more than Ishtos, so it's Bitul Mekach. And Ishtos itself, the Kinyin is okay, and you get a difference. And all this is, um, Kedesh Yir, as it more ends, the Zebazim of the Shir, the Togol Kerev, it's all within the time that you show to an expert. But after that, it's already too late. Um, right? And as Rashi says, Zebazim, or you know, or Bitul Mekach. But you know, Bitul Mekach, you can either get the difference or get more, is only with this year in the Togolo Krivus. According to this, clearly, as it comes out, clearly, and that's what really traces it as well, clearly the what? That if it's less than a shtos, mechili is immediate. Answering the first topic of the Gemara. And if it happened right away, does it happen right away or not? You see over here for sure, it happens right away, because if not, what's the difference? We say, Kadesh Yire, if it's a shtos, so the sale is okay, you get the, the difference. If it's le- more than a shtos, so then the sale the, the sale is, the, is bottom. Less than a shtos, there's a mechilo. But if after a year of the Togol Akrever, it's always a mechilo. Once you show it to an expert, it's over. So what's the between less than a shtos and a shtos? Shtos, you have till then to come and ask for the money. Or more than a shtos to come and rebattle it. Less than a shtos, you don't even have till then. Immediately, it's a bitul nekach. So, we will stop over here. This is just a complicated cheshman in the Gemara, but we stick here to Shat of Rashi, and the core of the Gemara came out very clear, very clear what the Mahalach is. We say the Gemara.